Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth 4 for another episode of Super Mario RPG. In the last episode, we tried to rescue Princess Peach, but Bowser's castle was taken over by the Smithy Gang. So now we're going to go tell the Chancellor, and hopefully not run into that toad again, because he doesn't seem like he has a head screwed in properly. Anyway, now it's time for Mushroom Way. Let's listen to that amazing music. Bum, bum, bum. And let's get into a fight. There's no, uh, unlike uh, Paper Mario, there's no like first attacks or anything. So just run into the enemies. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. But now we have Goombas. Now the reason why it says unarmed is because I don't have a weapon yet. But yeah, Goombas are very easy. I'm not gonna have stats on the enemies like I do in just a lot of other games. Uh, I don't have it handy on me. And, uh, it doesn't really matter. These guys die in one hit. That's the stat. <laughs> um, but yeah, you get two, one, one experience from each of them. So Goombas are the, that's great, Toad. Goombas are the lowliest characters. Goombas are the lowliest creatures that you ever do. But yes, we also have Sky Troopas. I don't know why they decide to rename the Paratroopa, but there's a lot of enemies in this game that have strange names. As you can see, they have quite a bit more health than, uh, or quite a bit more defense, I should say, than the Goombas. So, uh, yeah, they can die in- wow, you're not attacking me at all. Why? Why, game? I'm not- I'm not- oh, maybe they were in defense position. Yes, I summoned Sky Troopa in defense position! Not Sky Troopa! Goes to Shadow Realm, but yeah, uh, I guess they were defending. Ah, die, 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 die. Yeah, those are time, so if you hit it, you hit it. Um, there are also hidden chests. That's that's how chests work, by the way. But yeah, um, they're essentially item blocks, but they could have coins and things. Um, there are also hidden chests, but we're not gonna be finding one until we get to Mushroom Kingdom. But I will try to get every single one in the game. So that's gonna be fun. Uh, let's just attack this guy. Yay! Uh, I'm gonna be cutting out a lot of the fights if it's just the same enemies, unless it's, you know, I guess a scripted fight or whatever. You technically do have to keep saving Toad because he's not gonna let you go otherwise. <laughs> Little jerk. Nah, my life was flashing. I saw my life flash before my eyes. You saw something. You saw something in return. You got a honey syrup. Honey syrup uh, restores your flower points. So that's good. Well, if you use a uh, special attack. I guess we can use special attacks on this guy. I'll show it off in this battle. So for special attack, you want to go to Y. Just like jump on the character. And you're going to want to press Y right before you hit the guy. And yeah, if you hear, hear that sound, then you did a good job. Uh, doing it as a special time, uh, doing it at the right time increases your damage, obviously. Uh, interesting thing, oh uh, yeah, that guy creeps out of there if you notice there. Um, interesting thing about the timing, it's, there's actually two, there's like, uh, a reward for good timing and a reward for perfect timing. But as you can see, our little toad friend got himself kidnapped. Again, what the heck did I just hit? You guys are just hiding everywhere. <laughs> but yeah, our toad friend got hit, kidnapped again. But I actually didn't know that there's some, some things in this game have good timing, some things have, uh, like perfect timing bonuses it's weird i always thought it was just one standard thing but that's because this game has a lot of math behind the mechanics so anyway as you can see the goomba here is on a rotating flower uh if we uh kill him and go on the flower then we'll be able to use it to jump yay zero damage we're so good at the defending so yeah once you're on the flower You'll just kind of turn in all directions. Oh, I th really thought it was going to get off before. Oh, well. <laughs> That's overkill right there, folks. I know I'm not cutting the battles out, but whatever. Um, so yeah, you just want to press jump when you're facing in the... That's not the jump button, Dovey. When you're facing in the correct damage, and it will launch you. So let's, let's save. Let's save our little totemist friend. He can go back to playing his guitar or whatever toads do. That's a reference to the Mario Brothers movie, guys, if you didn't get it. That was a close call! Here's a token of my appreciation! You have a lot of items. Can I just have them beforehand? Okay, so Flower Tab. Flower Tab is a very nice item. Uh, you're gonna love them. Uh, essentially, what a Flower Tab does 
It raises the flower points by one, and it doesn't only do that, it, well, let's use it now. It fully restores your flower points. So you can either use it right away to immediately raise your flower points. There's nothing, oh yeah, there is something up there, okay. Uh, you can either use it to immediately raise your flower points or you can save it. And we just got a second one. So now we have 12, um, except that those ones don't restore, just the ones that you use. Uh, so yeah, you can save it for either like boss fights or things. That was a full heal, by the way, as you can see, we are now fully healed. <laughs> Surprise, that's what a full heal does. So yeah, you can save it for boss fi uh, like right before a boss fight or something, or if you just run out, and uh, that'll be just a, a good a good way to restore uh, all your flower points without wasting a honey syrup or anything. So uh, just something to think about, something I'll probably do. Uh, when I played this game in the past, I used to just use it right away, and it's honestly uh, okay to play the game either way. Um, I don't think, this game isn't particularly hard, except for certain bosses, but anyway, we have a new enemy here, the Spiky. I don't know why they renamed the Spiny, but again, Yeah, those guys are annoying to try to dodge, but um, yeah, that's they just renamed all the enemies, and that was that was really bad timing, Dovi. Probably should use jump on him. Okay, if I don't kill you now, I'm gonna die in the second episode. I should probably heal myself. Yes, items, mushroom, you just have to drag it over your character and use it, yay! I actually should be getting a level up soon, which should be nice. And you just popped out of there. Okay, so sometimes enemies will give you something, aha, uh, like a flower, and that flower will either be like an attack up, or uh, it'll let you uh, go again, or just do have a lot of nice effects. So let's take a look at the attack up effect. Obviously, it's only going to last until the end of the battle. Somehow, as some have uh, effects that uh, affect the end of the battle, like giving you more experience or things like that, or making like a little roulette thing. And we leveled up, so now we reached level two. This is what the level up screen looks like. Uh, all your stats will increase, or you'll just have a general increase. Hey, look, our defense went up, yay. It's a nice boost in HP and attack. I don't know if it's set or not. It's probably uh, random, uh, like what you get with each one. But uh, you also get every level up uh, the ability to further raise another one of your stats. So we can uh, do attack and defense, which is, that's not very good. Uh, HP, which we can raise nicely, and special will be up by three. I'm actually gonna go for that. Usually I only raise special when I gain a magic attack, but um, you only get one here, and this is a plus three, and that also just, that randomly changes every level up. So I usually go for whichever I would get the nicest bonus out of. Uh, but yeah, let's see. And there's our friend again. Hey, are you looking at me? My hammer and I don't like you. I love this guy. And his hammer. Mario, you better be careful. He's definitely got a mean streak. He's got a mean streak a mile wide. It is the rabbit. Okay, well, uh, I'm gonna take Toad's advice. Oh. <laughs> okay, now I can actually one shot all the enemies here, which is really nice. So there's nothing else here, okay? I was gonna say, I'm gonna take the Toad's advice and just leave. But no, he's blocking our way. Now you got my hammer angry. You shouldn't have done that. Yeah, we didn't get him angry. His ham- He's like that guy in the, uh, the cantina, or wherever it was in, uh, Moss Eisley Cantina, I guess. <laughs> My friend doesn't like you. Okay. I don't like you either. <laughs> now you shouldn't have done that. And now we have our first boss time against Hammer Bro. And wherever the other Hammer Bro came from. But anyway, we're gonna go all out. Let's jump on them. Um, if you're not prepared, I guess these guys <laughs> hammer time. Ha ha ha. I'm not sure when the... Ha ha! I'm not sure when the timing is for that other one, but... Uh, we should be able to kill this guy in two hits. Yeah. And when bosses die, they make that. You don't get all that money, but that's just a boss dying animation. Uh, when you uh, beat the first one, the second one uses Valor Up, which I believe raises defense. I don't think it also raises attack, but I could be wrong. Aha! So yeah, we're just gonna keep jumping on him till we're out of jumping ability. Hammer time! 
Oh, it missed. Okay. So, yeah, that's just punch. And, yeah, this guy... Okay, so they each had 50 health. Because I just... I did a total of 52 damage there. So they each have 50 health. And we get a flower jar. Lots of coins and experience points. Uh, let's see. The flower jar is like a flower tab, but it gives you a plus three. So it's very nice. And has the same effect of restoring everything. Thanks, Mario. I was running so fast I wasn't watching where I was going. Yeah, you do that a lot. Mushroom King's just ahead. We're almost there, Mario. But what about the hammer? Hey, where'd this hammer come from? Well, you see, when a mommy hammer and a daddy hammer love each other very much, they go to a tree and they carve out a baby. It's made out of wood. Hmm, hey, do you know what this is? I believe that is a hammer. Oh, oh. It has the hammer bros insignia on it. No one stands a chance against you when you whomp them with this. You're creeping me out. You never know, it might come in handy. Oh yeah. Mm. Picked up a hammer. Let's get a move on. I'll see you in the Mushroom Kingdom. Wow. Anyway, now we have our first weapon. Yay. So yeah, just go to weapon and then go to hammer. And as you can see, it gives us a plus 10 in attack and a new type of uh, attack. Each weapon has its own type of uh, timing. I need a tissue, excuse me. Each weapon has its own type of timing. Uh, that timing, like for, for an attack, the punch... <laughs> Uh, like Mario has uh, punches and he has hammers generally. That's his two types of attacking. So we'll get to the hammer in a minute. There's also shells. What did I just go back into? No. So now that we've completed Mushroom Way, we can go to the Mushroom Kingdom or back to Mario's pad if we want. But let's go to Mushroom Kingdom. <laughs> I'm sorry, in each new area, I'm going to have to just listen to the amazing music. Anyway, now we're in the Mushroom Kingdom! Hey, did you just see a crocodile around here? He talks like a mobster wannabe. I'm sure he's up to no good. Hey, wait a sec! My wallet's gone! Oh, no! I'm not gonna give all the toads annoying toad voices, just the, the red-headed toads. Otherwise, I would kill my, uh, kill my voice. Hey Mario, look what you're standing in! You have to jump there. Ha, <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> <clears throat> anyway. Well, my grandchild turns out to be just like the princess. Isn't, isn't he a boy? Isn't this a boy? Mario! Oh, that's a girl, okay. Let's say you and I get hitched in a few years, okay? Just give me time to grow into my mother's wedding dress. Okay, I'll be waiting. That's not creepy. It's so nice to see our young ones having a good time. Yes, I'm gonna jump on your bed because I'm an adult! Ha <laughs> Um, item shop. So yeah, the, the spinning mushroom means item shop. Mario, what a pleasant surprise! What a Frog Fuchsia's his grandchildren. Frog Fuchsia's? It's like Frog and Confucius, yes. We'll see him later. Is running errands in town today? I haven't seen him though. Oh, you're here to shop! Yeah, what do you want? Well, we can buy things now, and what we can buy is shirt! It's a shirt! Um, we're gonna buy a shirt! Because that's our armor. We're also gonna buy jump shoes. Jump shoes lets you use, uh, Jump against any foe. I guess there's some enemies you can't use it on. Maybe spiked enemies. I don't really know how that works in this game. Uh, but it also makes your jump. Uh, it also gives you better stats. So, uh, so we have here the mushroom, the pick, uh, the honey syrup, which recovers 10 flower points, the pick me up, which revives damned allies. You're going to love this. And the able juice, which is essentially a uh, a full heal or what's the final fancy equivalent? Um, oh goodness gracious. Uh, Heal status, all status problems. A remedy, there we go, Dovey. Uh, but I don't use them. I, I, I don't think I've ever used them. But anyway, let's go equip our shirt! So yeah, shirt gives us defense and magic defense. Quite a bit, actually. 
And our accessory is going to give us one defense, five magic attack and one magic defense. That's beautiful. Uh, we'll buy the other stuff later. Actually, if we go over here, this guy has a basement. This basement is very special because in our ba in the basement we have this guy. In order, I order you to stand before me. Okay. I now order you to jump. Don't order me around, old man. I'm gonna stay here forever now. Oh. In this world, there are things called hidden treasures. Use your awesome jumping ability to look for them. Okay. I wish you luck in the future. So now what we're gonna do is stand on this guy's head. And the reason why we're gonna do that is because we want him to walk to certain places in uh, downstairs. Yes, just in the corner, you idiot. Uh, there's actually more hidden chests here. You idiot, stop it. Oh my god. What's wrong with you? There's one more hidden chest, I think, anyway. I think it's over in front of the staircase here, so I'm gonna wait until he moseys over there. <sighs> Good. Good. No. Good. 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 Yay! No. There we go, and we get another flower. So now our flower count is up to 14. Okay, so those are the first two hidden chests of the game. I believe there are 39. Uh, there's nothing special for getting all of them. It's just a, uh, it's a, uh, I guess achievement type of thing. Um, not achievement, like, you get items from each of the chests, so that's that. Uh, this is the inn, the star means inn. Uh, the inn is where you go if you want to restore your HP and flower points, but there's really no point to do that right now. But inns also have save points! Hello, child. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me! Oh, shut up! Oh, now look! I lost because of you! You lost the game? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, but yeah, if you talk to this guy like 500 times or something, he gives you the game he's playing, which is this like beetle thing, which I'm going to be showing off much later. Because I don't want to do that right now. Not your last save. Save here anyway? Yes, that's actually an interesting feature that I didn't know existed, but it tells you that's not your save file. The reason why I'm saving right now is because there's going to be a part coming up. Hello. It's not like I'm always sleeping. Yeah, it is. Uh, there's going to be a part coming up where uh, I may or may not have to reset the game uh, for a hidden chest. The only, really the only missable hidden chest in the game. But anyway, uh, that's going to do for this episode. So we went through Mushroom Way. We got to Mushroom Kingdom and uh, heard all the awesomeness. What's up? Mario, hurry! The Chancellor waits! Hurry! The Chancellor waits! And, uh, yeah, we see all these cool people, and Bowser's got her again! Oh, no! My brother's waiting for you upstairs! Hello? One, two, three, if I practice, I'll jump as high as you, Mario! Sure, sure! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, this has been several so before <laughs> with Super Mario Arpeg. <laughs> okay, I'm getting off. <sighs> Thank you very, very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode where we're going to talk to the Chancellor. Goodbye, everybody. Bye bye.